we were told to cut salt from our diets. The debate is settled. The authors found a link between low levels of salt consumption and greater risk of death. We were told chocolate is unhealthy junk food. The debate is settled. Recent studies have shown that certain chocolates can be good for us. The fact is, where science is concerned, there are very few issues that are settled. And nowhere is this more true than in the complicated area of climate science. In recent years, the science behind onerous environmental regulations appears to be becoming increasingly one-sided. Because of the cost of these issues, it's very important for the public to understand the broader scientific perspective rather than one narrow view. The Cato Institute is proud to announce the expansion of its Center for the Study of Science, adding several world-class scholars to a team that will continue to use sound science to answer questions related to environmental regulation through an objective framework. Greenhouse gas emissions in the United States have been on the decline for uh, a decade now, and they stand at levels characteristic of the early 1990s, and this has happened without government restrictions on greenhouse gas emissions. But it is simply impossible to find econometric data on a national level which shows that a government funding science has any positive impact at all. The real issue is not based on yes or no, do you believe in climate change? Is it warming? Is it cooling? It's always based on how much and also, and this is equally important, how relevant. We're basing our regulations upon computer models that haven't been accurate for almost two decades now. I don't think that's a good way to develop national environmental policy, do you? The basis of the switch to a linear dose-response relationship was based upon ideologically oriented science. And this isn't a trivial point. We are talking about the fundamental data set that they use for drawing all these other conclusions. And uh, they're remarkably casual about the uh, quality control process here. The new Center for the Study of Science will bring the public the story behind the scary stories.